Sagittus. Hey guys, salut mes amis, ok, hallo gebar. Maxime here. I made a video on the SG553 and talked about how useful it is since it's only $50 above an AK. If you haven't seen that video, check the description. But a lot of you that saw it seemed to want another one for the AUG. The AUG has also been reduced, so it's just $50 above an M4. So I thought, hey, why not? Let's do the same thing and ask if it's OP with the new price. I'm going to compare it with mostly the M4A4, and not the silencers so much because they're less similar, but I'll still talk about it. First of all, the spray patterns. M4 has a pretty easy recoil, but the AUG isn't that much worse. And it's definitely easier than the SG. It also fires at the same speed as the regular M4, with a holy hell of nearly 666 rounds per minute. Side note, the silencer only fires at 600 rounds per minute, most likely due to the fact that it only carries 20 bullets. The deploy time is a little bit worse than the M4, but the reloading time for immediate refire is very noticeable. Filling the clip is also a tiny bit slower on the AUG. So far, the gun doesn't really impress much. But here's some good news. The AUG has the best tapping accuracy out of all automatic rifles. Even though it doesn't look like much, it beats the regular M4, but also the silencer. What I'm saying is, if you love tapping, you can be sure to get some easy headshots with the AUG. Now for the running speed. With the knife, you run at 250, with the M4 225, and the AUG 220. This is 10 units faster than the SG, but still 5 units slower than the M4. Overall, it's got good mobility, and makes it even more intriguing than the SG. Now let's look at the scope, which is definitely one of the biggest selling points, just like the SG. Using the scope gives you better overall accuracy and lowers the recoil amount even more. Is the recoil better than the M4 silencer? Yes. Just a little bit though. Now for the base damage. If you hug an enemy and aim for the stomach, you deal 41 with the M4 and 34 with the AUG, which is a lot of damage with the M4 on unarmored opponents. And if the player has armor, you deal 28 with the M4 and 31 with the AUG. So what that means is, you actually deal more damage against armored opponents. This is a big key factor for using the AUG, but also, if the T's have full Kevlar with helmets, the AUG will only need one bullet in the head if they're close. If you use one of the M4s, you need two bullets in the head under the same conditions. This is a big deal, especially now that the price has dropped. So in the end, OP? I mean, you can easily replace it with the M4A4. Even though it's not superior against unarmored opponents, the AUG shines against armored opponents, especially because of the one bullet kill factor that I explained before. Learning the spray pattern for the AUG shouldn't be so hard. You can always scope if needed to safely destroy some watermelons. Do I like it more than the SG? As a matter of fact, I do. Now here's an interesting strategy that you may want to try out. Gobby has the M4 silencer equipped and uses the AUG as a substitute for the regular M4. Since it's only $50 more in price, he can switch between playing with a hard punching ammo filled rifle, which also has a scope, or go with a sneaky stealthy rifle instead. I think it's pretty smart. Do you think this strategy will be used by a lot of other people now? And will you try it out? Let me know down below. Sadly, there's a lack of good yellow skins for it. RIP. Oh, and I quickly want to announce that ECL Season 3 just went live. Season 3 will go back to the roots, merge divisions, and also introduce a new game mode called Overtime, where you can play overtime matches. And for the first week that it's out, you can try it for free. That's only half of Season 3, but it's a really good time to test out ECL if you haven't. Link is in the description. ECL for new people is a premium matchmaking service where we try our best to keep the environment friendly so it actually becomes fun again to play solo or duo queue. That was the video. If you want to support my channel, make sure you like the video, subscribe with notifications on, and I'll see you guys soon. Stay awesome and go bananas.